everyone welcome back to my channel and welcome to day goodness knows what in Doctor Who December it is time for another classic Who reaction the Robots of Death part three um where are we in the month let me just try and establish myself a bit un secundo I reckon we are Friday the 11th ish wait ish yeah so if we are happy Friday if we're not then bugger it um really do, do you know what this is one of those stories where i almost don't i just want to get watching it uh i watched part two yesterday so it's not like i've left it too long but um this is the last time i can film now until next weekend and I, I don't want to wait the week so i'm just gonna get cracking with it i assume it's a four-parter i hope it's a four-parter because i want to know what's what the outcome's going to be um I also feel like I'm I I I kind of have this personality where I'm always ready for the next thing I'm like yep yeah, okay let's move on yep yeah, okay let's move on and I'm trying to just slow that down a bit and especially because I'm really excited to see Leela go to earth and see her reaction to so many things because she's come from a completely different world so I am trying to just not rush things there's no rush you know we've this is our quality time and i'm gonna take my time um this afternoon my time now is actually also my giveaway which i'm really excited to do um and i hope the prizes go to genuine supporters of the channel actually to be fair everyone that's entered is a regular subscriber which makes me very happy so by the time you're watching this if you have one congratulations i'm gonna stop talking let's crack on oh he's pissed Oh, didn't think it would be that easy. Oh, good. Now our troubles really begin. Oh. That's a bit rubbish, isn't it? Ooh, I like all their mugs and stuff, like the mustard colour. What is he up to? No. I'm so confused as to who's doing this. That robot hasn't got a thing around its neck. Oh my god. So now he's got proof. Proof that it's the robots. I mean, I do think that was a, like, I think his reaction was a little OTT, you know. Is SV7 control? Stand by. Prepare to accept computer signal. Prepare to accept computer signal. 
What is happening? Secondary command channel open. Whoa. Dude, the fuzzy eyes. I, I, I understand. I understand. Let go, brother. You are one of us now. Oh, I was just thinking then, what did that remind me of? And that reminded me of, um, in the, in the silence of the library when she's like, I, I, I. He's not meant to be able to speak because he's dumb. Would you care to explain that? I see. Well then. Perhaps I'd better tell SD7 you can talk. <laughs> Priority red. Ooh. Priority red. Oh, Taron's the guy with the with the cloaky thing on his head that was putting the, the fuzziness into the robot. That's Taron, right? I have oui? checked extensively. There are only the crew and you. Nope. But you don't know what he looks like. But I know what they The commander's Taron. The commander's Taron? Yes, you fail, you fail, but congratulations, failure is one of the basic freedoms. Listen. Do you think that looks a likely place? Likely for what? Well, it tells him is on board. He'd have a workshop. Mm. Won't you come with me? Yes, please. Good. Come on. The voice sounds like a a voice of um like a children's TV show from the 80s or something. Who sleeps up or upright like that? Ooh. <gasps> oh gosh, get your knife out, Leela. Throw some liquid on him. She is run out of the room. Okay. 
baby steps. Kojima, desk, pool, everyone, and get them to the command deck. Get the robots out of there and secure the doors. Is that clear? But is this impossible? Just do it, Juice. What do you want? To kill you. I must obey my orders. It is forbidden for robots to harm humans. My command program has been restructured. All humans are to die. What are you doing here? Why? Does it upset you? The penalty for what you have done is death. That's far enough. What are you doing here? I followed you. I've come over here to bow you. Disturb you. Hmm. So it's Taron, right? The the guy that went missing that was is the scientist in robotics is going to be the leader, right? Um, this is just turning out to be a bloody great story. D84, I look, I never thought that you could feel an emotion or feel a like towards a robot, but I really like him. He's really cute. Um, I, I guess, you know, he's considered dumb because he doesn't speak, but he does speak. But he just seems really lovely. Um... And and, uh, and human-like. So I suspect he might get killed because he's obviously gone to help that commander. But I, I just love this whole this whole concept. And it's really interesting having Leela kind of not having the Doctor by her side all that much. She's kind of gone off and done a little bit of her own thing, which is nice to see that side of a companion and how they cope and... You know, when she bandaged the lady's arm, the doctor was impressed. So she's going to have great survival skills just because of where she comes from. It's just really great. Really, really great so far. I don't I don't really have much more to say other than it's bloody brilliant. And actually, um, a lot of you have been saying that this is one of your favourites, if not your favourite. So, yeah, I can't wait till I, I finish the story and we can have a proper discussion about it. Right. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed and I will be back tomorrow with another reaction.